the screen and today I am going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is Wherever You Go, Roots. Let's read. A famine came to Israel elementary. Naomi and their sons went to Moab to find food. Element died. The sons married Mo Moabit woman Opa and Ruth. Then the sons died too. So like one woman called Naomi and his husband Element has gone to Moab to find food. But Element died and his sons also married. But those sons also died. That's a very sad. It's so sad. They have all gone. The three women had no husbands. When the famine in Israel was over, Naomi decided to go home. Saying Moab, she said to her daughters in law, It's your home. So Naomi like, said to three has a three women didn't have any husbands because like they have all their husbands has all died. So Naomi said like Oh stay here because it is your home and also your husband has died so Naomi said to stay here but to the daughters in law. Huh? Now I was going to go back to Israel because their sons and husbands all died. Opa stayed, but Ruth said, Wherever you go, I will go. Your people will be my people. Your God will be my God. Together, Ruth and Naomi went back to Israel. So, Opa stayed, but Naomi has gone with. Oh, sorry, Ruth has gone with Naomi. Like, they will be very sad because their husbands all died. That's from the Bible then. Belt of Truth. It was harvest time in Israel. Now we told Ruth to go to gather the bits of grain left behind in the field. A field belonged to Boaz, elementary's relative. Boaz approached it, Ruth. So, um, Boaz was elementary's relative. And Naomi said to gather the bits. Like, so there was a one thing that if when they have all like the bits, and like some bits will be left behind, like that. Some bits will like will be on the ground because like 
So the Israel people didn't pick that because it was for the poor people. It was left, almost left for the poor people. You're very kind to Naomi, said Boaz. Living home must be very hard. May God bless you. He gave Ruth's food and tallest workers to watch over her. So Boaz was a very kind, rich man. Like Boaz was saying to Ruth that you have like take care of Naomi very good so like thank you and he gave some food and also he told his workers to watch over him <laughs> Bruce told Naomi what happened Naomi smiled when someone dies, his closest relative cares for his family. That person is their family. Redeemer. Boaz is our family redeemer. Stay close with him. So Naomi like heard what happened like and he was very like, surprised and he smiled he she said like stay close with her because like uh, family when some people died like his fam what is it? Family Redeemer have to take care of for another person. Question. What gift did Boaz gave to Ruth when he told his workers to watch over her? Number two. The food. So Ruth stayed close to Boaz. He liked her more each day. Boaz... Brought elementary slam and took care of Naomi and Ruth. Then he asked Ruth to marry him. So like they were like um, more closer. They were more closer. And like Boss was very good man because he have by by the elementary slam and took care of Naomi and Ruth. And like they marry. <coughs> okay. Ruth had a son called Obed. Obed's son was Jesse. Jesse's son was David, and David became an Israel's greatest king. So God bless Ruth, just as Boaz has prayed what happened. So like, God bless Ruth's family. So like, Ruth's grand-grandson is David, the best king of Israel. David's Israel greatest king was Ruth's great grandson. True. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did it enjoy? Then next time I'll read another good story. Then let's see you next time. Bye.